North Dakotans are also a step closer to being able to vote to allow online sports betting. The House of Representatives passed a pair of resolutions that would put the issues of both internet live poker and sports betting up for a statewide vote. The issue has come up time and time again. And while those in opposition are concerned about addiction and other issues that may arise with this being allowed, supporters say it's up to the people. Poker is something that's kind of going on now, but there's no regulation in the state as far as taxing that or anything like that. We've had this discussion a couple sessions in a row now, so this is just um, this is us putting it on the ballot again for the people to decide whether or not this is something they think North Dakota should be a uh, part of. A third bill, contingent on the other two passing, was put to vote today as well, but did not get the okay. It would have allowed for local tribes to negotiate an agreement to conduct online gaming and sports betting. John Nelson, who introduced the bill, says this decision was surprising and somewhat frustrating. This isn't the end of the end, end of the uh, uh, the discussion for sure. Maybe we just didn't make the case that uh, that this was uh, important. You know, that important. There's always those in the legislature that don't that don't want any expansion of gaming. Um, the, you know, there's that there's that focus. But the other bill, the other bills passed, so it didn't appear like that was a a, a deal breaker. House resolutions 3012. 12 and 30, 32 will go on to the Senate, then the governor's desk. After that, it would be up to the people of North Dakota to, to decide in the next statewide election.